Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this ETF report for PowerShares QQQ Trust. The report was first published on our website February 11, 2022, but this is a more detailed version which also includes some fundamental data you need to know. In this 7 to 10 minute long video we give you the information you need to know about PowerShares QQQ Trust for the upcoming trading day on Monday 14th, like support and resistance levels, signals, chart analysis, price to earnings ratios, and possible trading levels. Make sure you watch the entire report so you don't miss out on some key information needed for your trading. Please remember to subscribe so we can continue to grow and give you these free videos. Make sure to hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new video. Now just sit back, relax, listen and watch the screen as we will show you some interesting data as we move along with the report. In this section you will get some information about the current PowerShares QQQ Trust performance to better understand the where the ETF is right now. In our systems, the PowerShares QQQ Trust ETF currently holds a minus 2.681 score, and our system has ranked PowerShares QQQ Trust sell candidate since February 11, 2022. Over the next few days, we will see how this evaluation performs. In our daily updates for PowerShares QQQ Trust our last headline reads, Red Day on Friday for PowerShares QQQ Trust. The PowerShares QQQ Trust ETF price fell by minus 3.17% on the last day, Friday, February 11, 2022, from $358.43 to $347.06, and has now fallen three days in a row. During the day the ETF fluctuated 4.13% from a day low at $345.80 to a day high of $360.07. The price has risen in six of the last 10 days, but is still down by minus 1.35% for this period. Volume fell on the last day along with the ETF, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the ETF. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 11 million shares and in total, 100 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $34.80 billion. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the ETF was $408.71, and the lowest price was $297.45. Right now the price is 15.08%, or $61.65, below 52-week high at $408.71, which also is all-time high for the ETF. The PowerShares QQQ Trust ETF Trends, Predictions and Analyst Ratings Soon we will give you the analyst ratings for the ETF, but first the trends. The ETF lies in the middle of a wide and falling trend in the short term and further fall within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 11.65% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 15.14% and minus 3.21%. The 12-month trend it indicates a 21.26% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between 20.59% and 47.26%. This equals a price between $418.51 and $511.10 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets In this section, we will give you some information about signals found for PowerShares QQQ Trust. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the ETF. There are mixed signals in the ETF today. The PowerShares QQQ Trust ETF holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $356.86 and $372.58. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Thursday, January 27, 2022, and so far it has risen 1.75%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. 
Moving average convergence, divergence, holds a buy signal. Pivots gave a buy signal, 12 days ago. Bollinger, gave a buy signal, 12 days ago. The short-term moving average, for the three-month chart, gave a buy signal 4 days ago. The long-term moving average, for the three-month chart, gave a sell signal 28 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, in the three-month chart, gave a buy signal, 26 days. If we look at the 12-month chart we see, short moving average, gave a sell signal, 2 days ago. The long-term moving average, gave a sell signal 22 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, gave a buy signal, 18 days ago. Remember to go to our page, at stockinvest.us, if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for PowerShares QQQ Trust PowerShares QQQ Trust finds support from accumulated volume at $345.11 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This ETF has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the ETF moved $14.27 between high and low, or 4.13%. For the last week, the ETF has had a daily average volatility of 2.47%. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, PowerShares QQQ Trust meets first resistance at $351.69. If you do not hold PowerShares QQQ Trust shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn PowerShares QQQ Trust finds first level of support at $345.11 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. Other levels you should watch based on the famous Fibonacci model are Buy at $345.53, Sell at $356.43, We hold a negative evaluation for this ETF. No stop loss set. Is PowerShares QQQ Trust ETF a buy? PowerShares QQQ Trust holds several negative signals, and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this ETF. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Monday, 14th, we expect PowerShares QQQ Trust to open up $3.92 and start trading at $350.98. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.